Welcome back to the 80s Night 2000 Vibes Network. We want to thank y'all for joining us for episode two of the panel. Um, if you've already seen episode one, then you know that we're reviewing the hit show Bel Air. If you have not checked out the show, we will have the link in the description. We're going to make it nice and easy for y'all. Uh, I'm Darion. Today, joining me are my co hosts. Uh, I'm going to let them introduce themselves. Whoever want to start, go ahead, do your thing. It's the one only Jamar. It's Tri Burrow. Nah, nah, nah. Where you from, Tri? Brooklyn, New York. East yo, Coast. yo. <laughs> okay. <laughs> hey, me here. We, I, I can't. I can't hear you. You muted. You, you. Wow. Piano <laughs> school cue. And I'm leaving that in. Bro, you too young for that, bro. Don't know what technology. Go ahead. I'm Quan, aka Old School Q. AKA Sunday Night Slow Jam. Mr. Sunday Keep, Night Slow Jam. Keep Slow Jams alive. Yes. Oh, yeah. yeah. That boy put that smooth voice on. Hashtag <laughs> Keep Slow Jams alive. Man. Yeah. All right. So today we are reviewing episode four through six. If you want the first three episodes, well, like I said before, check out episode one of the panel. Um, Let's start with episode four. Do y'all remember what happened in episode four? I know it was a couple of weeks ago. But do y'all remember what's going on? Do y'all yep. need something? Um, uh, Will Will got caught with uh, drugs in his backpack that he had nothing to do with. That that was uh, all because of uh, Colton's friends. I think and, that uh, I think that was that was that was episode four. No, uh, episode four is when they were going door to door. Will yeah. and, and Colton. Oh. oh yeah, that was uh, that was my bad. That was based off. That was based. That was after the punishment that they got. Yeah. And, yeah. And they were helping um um Uncle Phil with his campaign or whatever. And yeah. Will is like telling um Colton. You know, you're doing something wrong when when you go door to door and nobody, you know, they they just shutting the door in your face or whatever. So we'll have to switch it up and you know, um, you know, do do things his own way and then show Carlton and then like he, when he showed Carlton like, yo, this is how you do it. You got to get in touch with the with the community and that's something that Carlton, uh, he wasn't in touch with the community and uh, uh they were doing it the you know Will's way and, and it was working, you know, and and um I um, think like that. I'm about to say before we get too deep into that, let's just say why. Uh, both of them, like in the episode, they show they have ulterior mo- uh, motives. They're not just trying to do it just to help. Yeah, they uh, both using each other. Exactly. Carlton wanted to go to I don't know what it, what was he trying to go to something with his dad. Race uh, track. Race yeah, track. He's trying to go with his dad. So him and his dad made an arrangement that if him and Will could go out there and help get voters to reg- get people to uh, register to vote. That his dad would give him the tickets, and they could do this with no problems. Will he he found out what Carlton was doing, so he went to Aunt Viv trying to do the exact same thing. What he wanted was to get his best friend uh, Trey to come out there to Bel Air, have a good time, get him away from Philly for a while. So they both, like y'all was saying, were using mm-hmm. each other. Both of them was doing it to get something, not because they really cared mm-hmm. about each other, but just to get something. And then, like you just mm-hmm. said, they were going door to door trying to get people to register. At first, nothing was landing. Every door that they knocked on got shut right back in their face. These people wasn't trying to hear that. They don't. A lot of times, people don't care about no politics. So mm-hmm. then, they both talked, and we were pretty much talking, like, hey, bro, what you doing is wrong. I, I'm going to say this. I, I wouldn't have gave a damn if it was Will or Carlton. I would have closed the door on both of them. <laughs> no difference. I'm like, man, man, go, go, go ahead somewhere with that, bro. Like, like, I was saying, like, if I wasn't re- already going to register to vote, I'm not going to do it. So could you You're not going to change my mind, right? Exactly. I'm through the window anyway. Who that is? Right, <laughs> the people. <laughs> I can't open those doors, man. I don't even know yeah. you. Especially if I see paperwork see, again. I don't see. I, I don't. I wouldn't do that because like I've I've opened the door. That was me before. I've, I've opened the door for like you know like younger kids that it, it's mm. a job for them and they're getting paid to do that. So I would want to hear what they have to say. I'm not just gonna slam the door because I know that it's a job for them too. And yeah. you know, um, like I, you know, even if I was registered, I'm like, yo, let me let me hear what this kid is. Saying.